I'm actually kind of shook. <laughs> Hold up. Lexi Luxury here. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Mm, 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 mm. So today we are doing another Bad Habit Beauty review. This is in fact another eyeshadow palette. I will go ahead and show you the inside while we're here and whatnot. But yeah, we're working with some gorgeous purples, some pinks, some blues. Definitely outside of my comfort zone, but I'm bringing you content. I'm bringing you purple. I'm bringing you life today. So yeah, obviously as you can see, this is the look that I pulled off with this palette, but the review and the tea and everything will be included in the rest of this video. So if you want to know the tea about this palette, then you better keep on watching. But before we get started with all that, make sure you hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notification, and also hit that big thumbs up if you like this video already. Okay, now. Let's get started. All right, so first off, I am going to show you the palette that we are featuring today. So the palette we're gonna be using is the Pretty Poison Palette by Bad Habit Beauty. First of all, look at the packaging. You know, I'm a packaging fiend, and this is absolutely beautiful. This is actually a brand new palette. It just launched on November 15th, so you guys can get this now at badhabitbeauty.com. I also have a super clutch coupon code for this one, you guys. I will go ahead and throw that on the screen now, and of course, it will be in my description box down below. And you could only use it for a limited time so you better use it right away while you can. It's literally 30% off of Bad Habit Beauty and then it's also valid for 25% off of shophush.com. So that's like I said a pretty clutch coupon code you guys. That's one of the best ones I've ever been able to get for you. This coupon code is only valid between November 23rd and November 26th. So now that we've gone over all those details let's go ahead and make this eye look happen. So I am going to start out with this color Pierced Heart. It's like a really pretty muted purple. Oh wow, I actually really, really love that color. I know it's like very muted, but just as a first crease color, that is gorgeous. It's also building nicely if you guys can tell, which is super important. For the next crease color, you know I have to do it. I'm diving into this Love Sick color. This pink is just way too bomb. It has to go on this eye look today. So I'm just using the same brush for this and I'm going just a little bit below that first crease color that we did. And then I just always like to make sure I get that outer corner really good with some product. I feel like it tends to get a little bit neglected when I am doing my crease color. So I always just make a point to go over there, add some more pigment. And right off the bat, I am really loving how well these colors blend together. I've pretty much found that with every Bad Habit palette that I've used so far. For the next and final crease color, we're gonna go ahead and dive into Deadly Dose. So I'm just using a bit of a smaller brush for this just so I can really get in that crease. We're gonna try to keep this as close to the crease as possible. Wow, right off the bat, I'm already loving this Deadly Dose with this Love Sick color. This is like the exact amount of depth that I wanted to add to my lid, so I'm really glad that worked out. I'm actually kind of shook. <laughs> I am gonna grab Pierced Heart and Lovesick and just mix them together a little bit, go along the top section of the entire eye look that we just did just to blend it out, add some of that color back. For the lid color, I am going to grab this color Sting all the way in the bottom corner of the palette. I just like to take my index finger and press into it, and then I just press it right onto my lid. I've been doing this exact routine for my eye makeup for the past few months, and it's actually been my like favorite go-to, like quick and easy eye makeup. And then I just take whatever is left over on my finger, and I very lightly just start blending it into those crease colors, just so it looks like there's like a nice shimmery glaze over them. Wow, this sting color is so beautiful. It also like kind of gave us a little bit of warmth to the eye look, which I felt like I was needing just to balance out the purple. Wow, okay, I'm loving this, especially with my hair right now. Like, hello. Okay, if you guys felt like you lost any of that like purple and pink color, you can just go back in with any of the brushes with any of the colors on them and add some back in. I am actually gonna go ahead and do that real quick. All right, so just to give you guys a close up of what we've got right now, such beautiful colors. And like I said, they blended together so nicely. I think that's honestly the best thing about this palette is that the colors do work really well together. Since this is a specific review video, I do just want to keep the focus on the eyeshadow palette today. So I'm going to finish up my makeup, do my foundation, my cream contour, my highlight, my lashes, all that good stuff. And then we're going to come right back at you and smoke out this lower lash line. 
All right, so the rest of my makeup is done. Foundation on, highlight did. We are good to go. We just need to go ahead and smoke out our lower lash line. This is low key, like my favorite part of the entire makeup process, just because I feel like it totally changes the eye look, like completely. So I am gonna grab my little blending brush here. And to smoke out the lower lash line, I'm kind of wanting to use two colors. I'm gonna grab Love Sick, which is that gorgeous pink color that we used in the beginning. And we're just gonna go right till about here. And then I'm going to very carefully dip into Deadly Dose, and we're just gonna focus Deadly Dose on the outer portion. All right, we have made it. We are at the end of the tutorial, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this. Really quickly, just to give my overall thoughts on the Pretty Poison palette, I know I mentioned some things here and there, but I'm actually in love, you know? Like I said earlier, I don't normally use colors like this, but I am trying to get out of my comfort zone, so I'm so excited to be reviewing this today, and the consensus is that I loved it. I loved how the shades blended in with each other. The payoff is gorgeous, like everything, just everything. Wow, wow, yeah, nothing bad to say about this. So, like I said before, if you guys wanna cop this, I do have my discount code. I'll throw that on the screen again real quick so you don't forget. Once again, that will be between the dates of November 23rd and November 26th, so you better use that real quick. Not to mention, like, these aren't expensive to begin with, guys. They're so inexpensive. So if you're getting any type of discount on these, like, in general, you're saving hella coin, okay? So since this brings us to the end of the review, I just wanna say thank you guys so much for following and subscribing to me and all that good stuff. Here on YouTube and on Instagram and all my other platforms. You guys are amazing and I love you so, so much. If some of you aren't subscribed yet, then I hope that you do. Click that red button on your way out. Also go ahead and turn on your post notifications so you know when I post something new. And give this video a huge thumbs up if you liked it. I'm gonna go take a bunch of selfies now. <laughs> I love you guys so much and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye. I get that drip, you get drip. I for that bitch, I'm a pimp. I'm in love, but we not simple. I for that bitch, she get bent. We ain't that bitch with no tent.